Hello, welcome to welcome back to the program on Gospel Faith Television UK today, which is called Kobe Bryant. A tribute to Kobe Bryant, the king of the basketball court. And this is part two. Yeah, so I want to say that um, Kobe Bryant as well is a game changer. I wouldn't, I wouldn't really say I'm a passionate basketball viewer. Basketball is not really my favorite sport. But for people like sportsmen like Kobe Bryant, I began to watch the sport. And I was amazed. I was dazzled. By what this genuine great athlete could bring to the sport i built up interest so i began to realize that kobe bryant himself is a game changer sometimes within the sport sometimes within the sport maybe the sport is getting it's like sometimes in the basketball match there's not so much energy but kobe bryant has got the ability within any moment in the game to just change the whole game he's got the ability to make you see a different picture totally a game changer so he can Kobe Bryant can take the, the game a game of basketball from level 15 to level 75 in a split second magic magic will happen He's a game changer. And you see the opponents, they're like this. The opponents, they're like that. They're like that. How did that happen? Well, it's the brilliance, it's the brilliance of the player. You're watching a tribute to Kobe Bryant, the king of the basketball court. So he's a he's a game changer. And not only is he a game changer, because he believed in his skills so much, and because he's very talented as well at what he does, Kobe Bryant became a global superstar from playing basketball and believing in himself. Bryant. Br Bryant! You see that? He became a global superstar. And that's why I'm paying a tribute. To Kobe Bryant today on Gospel Faith Television UK. Kobe Bryant, a tribute to Kobe Bryant, the king of the basketball court is there. He became a global superstar. From demonstrating his skills and showing what he can do. Showing individual prowess on a basketball court. Interesting indeed. Interesting. For me, a player of Kobe Bryant's caliber made the NBA basketball in America bigger. He made it more broadened. He made it he expanded the sport with his individual brilliance. A lot of people around the world began to pick up interest. Who's that player that plays for the LA Lakers? I mean, the LA Lakers, they were already good. But with the contribution and the participation and the demonstration of Kobe Bryant, people around the world, began to take interest. Who's that player that plays for the LA Lakers in the NBA Jam? Bryant! You see that? From afar, it goes into the basket. Bryant! Accuracy. Bryant! He hang. Bryant! It's Bryant! Bryant! You see? He made the NBA bigger. He's got the ability. 
For me, a player like Kobe Bryant, because don't forget the topic for today is a tribute to Kobe Bryant, the king of the basketball court. Kobe Bryant for me made basketball more interesting. Of course, there's been basketball players that I played before. Kobe Bryant, Akimo Lajon, Magic Johnson, great players. But their time has gone past and it was the Kobe Bryant time. And he made great use of the time and the individual talent that he's got. So for me, Kobe Bryant made basketball a more interesting sport. I don't know what that means to you. He made basketball a more interesting sport. And you can't have the amazing skills of Kobe Bryant without dedication and hard work. So you see Kobe Bryant doing this and he's throwing the ball and saying, wow, this guy's a good player. Kobe Bryant, he, from any angle, doing all these kind of tricks and um, demonstrations. But what you don't see is the hard work. What you don't see is the sweat. When Kobe Bryant would be practicing, he said, if I jump this way and I jump back, it's impossible to look away and, and score and shoot. Look away and score and shoot. Is it possible? Kobe Bryant is the Ronaldinho of, of, of basketball. What you don't see is the hard work. There's no dull moment with Kobe Bryant. On a basketball court. He come to unleash the hard work. A crowd pleaser. Did you see that shot? Did you see that shot from Kobe Bryant? Did you see that? How did he do that? Wow! How did he do that? Kobe Bryant is good. Bryant! You see that? Sometimes you would even jump and throw the boy. Look away. He knows he scored already. Bryant! You see that? The hard work pays off. A special tribute to Kobe Bryant, the king of the basketball court. Now, to be a great player like Kobe Bryant in basketball, you have to have a variety of skills. <laughs> I don't want to say, I don't want to say some certain things. I don't want to look at other sports, but listen to this carefully. To be a winner and a champion and to win titles like Kobe Bryant, man, you got to work on your craft. You have to have a variety of different skills. Trust me. And you, and you must know when to pull them out. You can't be one dimensional. I want you want to be a champion. The, 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 the opposition or the opponent, they already know what you're gonna do. No, 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 no. That doesn't make you special. What makes Kobe Bryant a special player, a special basketball professional player, is that the man has got a variety of different skills. And he made the LA Lakers a special team. Of course his teammates are good. Of course his teammates, they love him. Of course he loves his teammates also. But Kobe Bryant made the LA Lakers a special team. I told you this. Yeah. You need special people to do special things. Kobe Bryant uplifts the crowd with his variety of diverse skills. The crowd, oh, Kobe Bryant, a great player. They can't get enough of Kobe. Kobe Bryant even uplifts the commentators. Oh, did you see that shot? 
Kobe Bryant, a three-pointer, a six-pointer. Kobe Bryant. They're screaming on the radio, Kobe Bryant. He uplifts the commentators as well. Skills. Kobe Bryant uplifts the viewers. <laughs> Even the viewers, when they're at home, maybe they're eating, maybe they're doing whatever. They say they talk what they do. They say, Kobe Bryant. God-given talent. It's a God-given talent. The topic for today is a tribute to Kobe Bryant, the king of the basketball court. And Kobe Bryant doesn't say, I'm a, a good player, I'm an individual player, so let me keep it all to myself. No, 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 he's a good team player also. So Kobe Bryant knows when to use his, his, his teammates. He knows when to use his teammates. He knows when not to go too fast. He knows when not to go too slow. He's a team player. He knows when to go forward. He knows when to stay in the middle. He knows when to break up attacks. He's a very decent team player. And he, we all know that he can be an individual player as well. He can pull off anything on the basketball court. Kobe Bryant is a great basketball player. And um, he was a joy to watch. I'm sorry about what happened, but I had to create this program for Gospel Faith Television UK. Uh, one great recognizes another great. So I just want to say Kobe Bryant, rest in peace. Um, Kobe Bryant, rest in peace. I want to say that it's not only basketball that will miss you. I want to say that the sport in general will miss you. Basketball in general will miss Kobe Bryant. There's no way that I wasn't going to do this program called a tribute to Kobe Bryant, the king of the basketball court. Like and subscribe to my videos. YouTube, Gospel Faith Television UK. This is a tribute to, God, to Kobe Bryant, the king of the basketball court. I'm happy that I got this out of the way. Share it. Tell your, your friends about it. There's more to come on Gospel Faith Television UK. I just want to say I love you. God bless you. Hold tight. Peace. Peace. Bryant. 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 Yeah, you got it. Peace.